Welcome to School of Civil Engineering. In my previous video, we have made a model for earthquake analysis according to PNC 2017 and also for according to ASCE 705 and ASCE 710. So, errors are EDUPS file and for that data I have told you that we'll analyze a building and also we have made a EDUPS model for that so I will complete that another part so let's start First of all, we will open our previous model and uh, you all know that this is our previous model and uh, by using that model, I will complete my check. So, first of all, I will go here and define load pattern and one thing you have to understand for our earthquake analysis how to do for our earthquake analysis we just do a thing that we take a uh, mass source as a on pass uh, hundred percent of dead load and 25 percent of live load we all ever we all know about that and in this video I will just consider that 200 PSF load I'll consider just 200 PSF load for our masters so I'll delete both of that okay and here I'll consider MS masters and here from here I will take it as other so at that load and I'll delete live load so this is a load and uh, by using that condition I will just assign on on it in our building and I will take load for our B and B C B and B C 2017 B and C 2017 And I'll consider that as a seismic load and uh, I will use user coefficient user coefficient so I'll add that and I'll go for modify and from here I do not change anything from here just I have to change base share coefficient and building height so and it will be from base floor to top floor here it's showing G10 it's represent the top floor and from Excel we'll find our value this is our value so value of C copy that paste it as value and from here I'll copy that and paste it in Oops. okay and below of K also below of K 1 1.477 1 1.4770 so our data is okay I can check that 0 0.039545 0 0.039545 okay and the value of k is 1.4770 4.70 so done we have found our value for that let's take it maybe everything is okay so okay 
and okay we have defined our load so before that we'll go here for mass source and mass source one from here we'll go for modify and here remove both of that and from here we'll select that mass source and multiply by one add okay our mass source is complete um here ms ms means we have oh, it is a defended load pattern and uh, also i will assign the load on building so okay and also okay so let's assign the load now go to first of all go to select object type floor select close and now go for assign shell load uniform load and here is the mass source and our load is Two thousand PSF. I mean pound. So not two thousand. Two hundred. It's two hundred. And go for apply. Okay. So we have applied our load. If you see here, right click load. Here value is gravity load two hundred pound. We have applied it, that load. Now. Our applied it load is okay. Now we'll go here for load case. They have two types of load case. BNB is 2017. It's represented as we are only working for earthquake load. So here BNB is 2017 and masters. I mean our load pattern. So we'll go it from modify. It's okay. For our calculate, we'll go here, and uh, you are seeing that as a mass source is co it considered MS one. I mean mass source one. It's considering mass source one. It's also a scale factor one. Okay. Okay. What is mass source one? Oh, I have previously defined it that here is a mass source one here MS and. The, the load we have applied it on our building and here if we go for masters modify we, we can see that our load pattern is ms i mean what we have applied it on our building and our multiply factor are on i mean um the applied it load all only will be counted by our software and it will consider as earthquake load okay okay now we'll go to again i'll check our model select wall okay it's taken and uh, no earning and about uh, this earthquake analysis video previously i have uploaded two video and to understand that video you have to see that two video the link are given in description and also have a full it has tutorial series and also have a it has problem and solution i mean how to download how to crack and how to do everything about it has 2016 you can see that playlist so I'll go for run and before that I have to save that. I'll save it. I'll save it here. B and B C A S C E analysis. Save. 
it's analyzing our building after that we check for that and then in next video I'll compare with my excel sheet and my items analyze and uh, I'm very sorry for that because I can uh, extend my video for my educational purpose as I am in last term in my PC engineering series that's why I'm quite busy and uh, I try to make video for you and I do it for my passion and I very I really really like to do video I mean I really like to make video for you and uh, I think it gives me a pleasure so that I can I can help some people what I know about my educational level and I have to grow my YouTube channel so that I can teach what I know in my co-learner so it's with me and support me thank you thank you very much it's working as I'm uh, screening I'm recording my PC that's why it's taking some time so I think you'll be with me And uh, I also want to request to you that you also should help your engineering discipline person who know about civil engineering and who are trying to learning about engineering. Uh, just it should to make our educational purpose or to make our educational field very great for other purpose and other person so that uh, we can make it big field and we can make a noble field for each other by helping each other so i think our model is ready now it's ready the model is ready now so As you have considered every point of our building so I'll go here for C deflection go to BNBC top of the 16 okay and so these are model and uh, it's also showing It's also showing our maximum deflection and our building de deformation and in my next video I'll show you that from ETAPS data and from our Excel data is it okay or not so thank you thank you very much let's stay connected till next video and 